Tip number three, let go of believing that you own the only truth about the situation. And by letting go of the belief that somehow you have the only point, and acknowledging that someone else has a different perspective, a different point of view, we move the conversation from conflict toward resolution. There's a fear involved in that sometimes, because it starts to feel like, well, maybe if I acknowledge anything that's good about that other opinion, it starts to feel like I'm agreeing. And it doesn't mean that at all. Rather, it requires a certain humility to say, this is my point of view, and I am genuinely interested in what is your point of view. And in there, maybe we'll find some common ground. Maybe we won't actually ever agree, but we can build relationship in the process. And in that way, we're doing something much more important than the destructive conversations we've been having.